Hi, this is Chris with Heritage Driven. Wanna do a quick walk around of this Defender 90 that we're finishing up right now. This one is Arctic White. First thing first, I wanna to touch on the bumper here. This is one of our Heritage custom bumpers. We make this in a winch version and a non-winch version. This is the non-winch version. This truck here is powered by the Cummins R2.8 turbo diesel engine. This is a turbo diesel intercooled engine. It has 161 horsepower. Shouldn't sound like a lot, but it's backed up by 310 foot-pounds of torque. It really gets you around. It's got enough pull to get you up hills. You can get over fire roads. You can pull out tree stumps, whatever you need to do with it. It's kind of a, a small engine with a lot of accoutrement, a lot of accessories that go along with it. And we've done a really good job, I think, of packaging this so it's very serviceable. So, you know, your overflows, your fuel filter, your oil filter, all accessible, easy to get to. Make sure that this truck is taken care of easily and can live up to the, you know, 200,000 miles or so that the Cummins engine is is capable of doing. It's backed up by a five-speed Tremec transmission, the 4020. That's an aluminum case overdrive transmission. The first gear is a rather deep first gear, which is great because with the torque of the engine and a low first gear, you can get over anything. As we go around, you'll see the suspension is a stock height suspension. About 32 inch DFG all-terrain tires are on here. It's really tuned for street and off-road use. And we do a really good job of making sure that it has good road manners, quiet tires, you know, good braking. It also has the, the traction it needs to be able to get through the sand and the, and the snow off-road. One, one other thing I mentioned real quick actually is the, the door hinges. You know, we're using these milled aluminum door hinges. I'm really a big fan of those, not just because they look cool, but they're also a bushing hinge. And what that gets for you is over time, the aluminum stock ones, those cast aluminum ones will, uh, will start to sag. And these uh, the bushinged ones will never sag on you. And even if they did, you'd be able to fix it pretty quick with a new bushing. So it's a really good setup. Um, aluminum handles are really nice and robust. These won't wear out. That's a wear piece on the plastic ones that are from the original. The interior here is a black leather interior. It's a real nice setup, um, very understated. I like the way that that came together. It's marine grade carpet, so it's uh, easily cleanable. It's waterproof. The dash itself, this is the Heritage dash. It's our custom dash. It has four vents for the AC system. It's a really nice setup. Just get a lot more airflow and more places of your body, a lot more comfortable setup for the passengers. As we move around to the back, uh, this one's set up with the two bench set up. Um, gives you actually quite a bit of leg room in the middle. Uh, it's comfortable enough. Uh, you could have four adults back here and they're, they're not dying, but you have plenty of room for tents, camping gear, whatever else you want in the back here. Um, those bottoms do fold up as well to give you a little extra room. Great space for dogs. That's what it's uh, used for quite often. Um, this has been a great build. Customers can't wait to have it. We've had a lot of fun being part of it. Uh, it's great to be part of their adventure. Thanks a lot.